Hiya folks! Before I get started, I want to remind you again that I am doing a retreat in Toronto, Ontario, Canada, and I'm pointing down because the links will be below. That's October 5th and 6th, 2019, so be there in Toronto, Canada, all you Canadians, eh? Uh, and I am speaking in Akron at the Akron Public Library, Highland Square branch, on Saturday, October 12th at 11 a.m., so be there for that. I'm doing a podcast from there, and the day before, Friday, October 11th, Zero Defects will be at Jilly's in Akron. So, that's that out of the way. Today, what I wanted to present to you is a project that maybe some of you will find amusing and maybe some of you will just want to ignore. This is something unrelated to Zen. It is a TV show proposal that I put together with a writer who I would gladly name, but I don't want to name him without his permission, so if he comes back to me, I'll name him in a later video. But he's a Hollywood writer who's a friend of mine, and the idea was to take a old Japanese special effects monster and superhero show and redub it in English as a comedy. Now this is not the f it is not an original idea. This uh, was done by Woody Allen in a movie called What's Up Tiger Lily in the 60s and in the 80s. The idea was taken up by Night Flight, whoever was behind Night Flight. They had a show called Dynamen, which they took an old uh, Toei superhero show by Toei. It's a company in Japan, uh, rivaled at Tsuburaya Productions, the people I worked for, and they dubbed it into funny English, and you can still find bootlegs of that around. Uh, Tsuburaya Productions actually worked on a thing called Totally Bogus at one point, which was a pilot for taking one of their shows and, and making it into funny English. And even though the idea's been done before, me and this friend of mine thought it was still a good idea, and we put together a proposal, and then the Japanese company who owned the program we wanted to work on said they needed a sample, and my writer friend was like, oh my god, they, they, they just got to get off the pot. And I said, no, 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 we'll, I'll make a sample. And I sunk a bunch of my own money into making this sample episode for them, a very short thing. And this it was about a year ago, and the project seems to be dead in the water at this point, so I thought, what the hell, I'll just put it up on my video channel as a video for your entertainment. Here it is, the show is called Mitsurugi, and I wrote this whole thing. A couple of lines were ad-libbed by the actors who were on it, so give them credit, but I basically wrote the script. I edited everything together, and the music that you hear is all played by me. All the, all the opening title theme and the background instrumental music that occurs later on, all by yours truly, written and played. Well, actually, the first thing is a cover of Turning Japanese by the Vapors. But anyway, there you go. Here it is. Mitsurugi, enjoy. Oh, <laughs> by the way, I get paid by your PayPal and Patreon donations, so donate below. Okay, now, here's Mitsurugi. Enjoy. Mitsurugi, let's go! Fuck him! Shin! Amy! <laughs> Right after Labor Day, unforgivable. Cool. Freeze frame. Freeze frame. Ah, oh, just got catch my breath. Ah, oh, crud. What's the timer on these things anyway? Huh? Ah, how do you like my special technique? Freeze frame. Run 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 Guys, let's go this way. Here. Here? Was this way? No, 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 no. That way. That. No. Keep going this way. This is fine. Over here. Oh. Guys, it's guys. Why are we standing here? This is the part where the song ends. Just stare into the distance and look cool. Tattletales are one thing, but that monster, it's really super big. I mean, it looks just like a giant pretzel roll to me. The kind you'd get at a shopping mall. That's true. I think it looks like a mayonnaise jar that you might get at a store. Come on, let me show you. 
Mr. Gorbachev, tear down this wall. I want you to do it now. What are those things? These are the little swords of Mitsurugi. When you put these little swords together, do you know what happens? What happens when you do that? I'll tell you what happens. First there's some big lightning, and then you turn into a giant guy with horns. Whoa! Whoa. Neat. 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 So cool. big! Awesome! Up till now, no one has ever used these swords. Why is that? Till now, no one has ever been cool enough to wear these swords. But you guys are really fashionable. Look, you've each got different colored helmets, and your scarves even match the helmets. It's a really cool touch. I'm really impressed. Your style is way beyond anybody in this podunk town. Tim, you get this blue one. It matches your scarf. Thanks. Jim, you get this yellow one. It matches your scarf. Cool! Amy, you get this red one. It matches my scarf! Tim, Jim, Amy, your lips may never match what you say, but you're gonna have to fight giant monsters somehow, someday, anywhere, anyway. Pledge that you'll always find giant monsters and stay fashionable. That's what the world wants from you. Get out there and show them what you got. Aye. Aye.